Hello everyone. Meet Mr. Marcus, a savvy business owner. With Zoho Books by his side, he effortlessly handles customer relationships, simplifies invoicing, tracks transactions and generates insightful customer reports. Marcus is equipped to excel in managing his business and delighting his customers. Like Marcus, we will see how you can also breeze customer management for your business through the Zoho Books iOS app. First, let's add your customers. Log in to your Zoho Books account from your iOS device. Click Customers at the bottom. A list of customers created in your organization will be displayed. Click the plus icon at the top right corner. Choose your customer type. Enter your customer's name, their company name, their display name, and their contact information. Choose the currency. If you have an overseas customer, you can choose the currency respective to their country and create transactions. Select the price list if you wish to apply customized rates for the items you sell to your customer and the payment terms. Select their tax details, their billing and shipping addresses, If the billing address is same as the shipping address, click copy billing address here to populate the details and click save. Click here to add contact persons to associate with your customers. You can also enable customer portal for them so that they will also be able to view and manage transactions. If you have the contact persons details saved in your device, you can import them. Click import and select import from contacts. Choose the contact you want to import and their details will be automatically populated. Alternatively, if you have the business card of the person, you can scan and add the details by clicking here. Then click done and save it. You have created a new customer. Instead of manually creating a customer each time, you can choose to import them if you have their contacts saved in your device. Go to Customers, click the plus icon and click Import. Choose Import from Contacts. Their name along with their contact details will be recorded automatically. Similarly, if you have visiting cards of your customers, you can scan them and import your customers to Zoho Books. Now, whenever you create a transaction, the customer's name will be displayed here. You can select the customer and proceed with the transaction. To create a transaction for the respective customer, select the customer, click the more icon and select new transaction. You can select if you want to create sales transactions, expenses or project for this customer. To quickly create a transaction, long press the customer and create invoice or estimate or sales order for your customer right from this page. For the purpose of this video, let's create an invoice for this customer. Customer name and the other details which we added during the customer creation will be auto-populated here. Add the items. Enter the rest of the details and save it. Now, let's say you are operating your business from India and you have customers across the globe. You can create transactions in their base currency by associating respective currency to the customer during creation. To do this, click the more icon at the bottom right corner, go to settings and click Customers and Vendors under Preferences. Enable Multi-Currency Transactions and save it. Now you will be able to create transactions for the customer in their base currency. Create an invoice, select a customer and associate the respective currency here. 
Let's look at some of the functions that can be performed in the customer's module. On clicking the more icon, you can keep track of the history of activities with your customer in the activities. Add comments for your internal use. Create transaction for your customers right from this page and keep track of the payments for those transactions in the invoice payment and view the attachments to the transactions. You can also generate a customer statement from the transactions for the period of your choice and email it to your customer. You can configure customer portal so that your customers will be able to view and manage transactions like accepting estimates or paying invoices. Additionally, if you have another customer with these similar details, you can choose to clone this customer instead of manually entering all the details. If you no longer want to create transactions with this customer, you can mark them inactive or delete it permanently. Apart from all these, you can call, mail or send direct messages to your customer on clicking the respective icons. You can also position your customer's billing and shipping addresses on the map using your iOS device. If you have any contact persons for your customer, you can call, send mail or direct message them on clicking the respective icons. Besides all these, you can search, filter and sort your customers on tapping this icon. If you want to modify the details of your customer, select the customer and click edit Make the changes and save the customer. If you have created any credit notes for your customer, you can view the unused credits for their transactions right from here. With Siri by the side, you can effortlessly access your financial data and perform tasks on the go. Enable Siri in your device. After enabling, open Zoho Books. Click the More icon at the bottom right corner and select Siri Shortcuts. Go to Customer and click the plus icon to add the shortcuts. So, whenever you want to perform the desired action, you can use these shortcuts to do it instantly. With Caller ID, every incoming call becomes an opportunity to provide personalized service and enhance your business relationships. Click the More icon and go to Settings. Then, click Privacy and Security and enable Caller ID. So, whenever a call comes in, Zoho Books instantly retrieves valuable customer details and displays them right away. And that brings us to the end of the video. If you have any queries, feel free to write to us at support at the rate zohobooks.com and we'll be glad to help you. Thank you.